Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to verify an object's construction constructor with in, instance of. Anytime a constructor function creates a new object, that object is said to be an instance of its constructor. JavaScript gives a convenient way to verify this with an instance of operator. Instance of allows you to compare an object to a constructor returning true or false based on whether or not that object has created, whether or not that object was created with the constructor. Here's an example. Uh, here we have a constructor um, called bird. This is a different way to write it, but it's the same way. So we could say function bird, and then here, or we can say let bird equal the function of name and color. So this is the same um, syntax, even though it's changed from the way that they wrote it last. Um, so here we're going to create a crow, and the crow ha has a name of Alexis, and it's black. So crow instance of bird is true. Why is that true? Because um, crow is a instance of the bird function and so that's why this returns true um, crow instance of bird yeah if an object is created without using a constructor instance of will verify that it is not an instance of the constructor so here we create a um, object called canary and we name it uh, mildred color yellow it's the same in terms of um, key value pairs as this guy as the crow here but it's not an instance of bird because we did not use the bird constructor to create it. So we want to create a new instance of house constructor, calling it my house. Um, so we'll say let my house, and we want to pass that is equal to a new house um, with a number of bedrooms. Um, I guess we'll just say it's a four bedroom house. And then we want to use instance of, um, so we would say my house. Uh, instance of to see if it's an instance of a house and because we're not console logging that we can't see if it gets us the right answer we want this to r r run to true so yeah it's running to true um, let's say let's see what would happen if we console log my house you'd see that we'd have an object of number of bedrooms of four now if we were to just say um, let another house is equal to uh, num of bedrooms and set that equal to four. If we were to console log uh, another house instance of a house, this is going to return false. Why? Because this object is not an instance of that, of the house. It's just an object with the exact same number, key, the same key value pairs. And so for that reason, we're going to get false here. And uh, even though my house and another house, both of these have look exactly the same in terms of the data that they hold, but they're not the same. And we can use instance of to realize that. Anyways, we run the test. I think that'll pass. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. We'll see you in the next lesson.